G'day Marvel Future Fight Gamers, Vader G here, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be having a bit of a look at uh, Namor in Combat Hero ABX, but some exciting news today, we've got the live stream scheduled, uh, three days time from now roughly, and we can see Mystique there, very cool Raven, really wanted her in game, Mr. Sinister as well, another villain coming, love the villains, keep them rolling that marble, really really uh, happy, the more villains you can introduce into this game. Uh, the better and more balanced it will be. Okay, so Namor for Combat Hero Day. This is a team we're looking at. Uh, my She-Hulk does have an insight. Uh, let's have a look at uh, Namor and his stats. It's got a uh, pretty high attack there. Attack speed 122%. That's it. Not not uh, maxed. Uh, and his dodge is obviously not maxed there at 61%, uh, which is pretty hard because he doesn't have a uniform, right? So it's hard to get that dodge rate maxed. He's got a number of Odin blessings from uh, Combat Villain Day. Uh, he's got Power of Angry Hulk with dodge isos to try and get that dodge up as high as possible. Uh, he's got a CTP of Rage, uh, of course, um, as we do for basically all Alliance battle units. Uh, the difference that we have here between Namor... Uh, for combat hero and Namor for combat villain is minimal besides the fact that he's obviously less powerful. Having said that, comparing to Captain America, I was getting about 4.5 million with Captain America with roughly the same amount of uh, Odin's blessings. Um, and with Namor, up around 4.8 million. So it's 300k increase. You've already got him built anyway if you've got him for uh, combat villain. Uh, so he is probably the choice if it's coming to between Cap America and and himself uh, for the Odin's Blessings race. Okay, so what we're going to do... Well, we've got some settings there. That was a bit shit. Uh, what we're going to do is get into this run, have a bit of a look at it. I'll put a uh, bit of music on so you guys can enjoy the run. All right, guys, so here we're about to go into our run of uh, Combat Hero uh, Alliance Battle going to wait till after the beast spawns and we're going to open pretty quickly with four cancel five cancel three so we're going to cancel nearly instantaneously the four skill and the five skill throughout the run so this is where it differs to combat villain uh, we're going to let, let the one three and two skill play out it differs in the fact that um, in combat villain we let the five skill run for 0.5 to one second uh, in combat hero you're not doing that you're still letting those three uh, one two and three skills play out and we're still cancelling a teeth tier three at the same point when he's tried and hits the ground anyway guys enjoy the run um, and hopefully it helps you out a little bit it helped me out getting some pointers on this run and uh, it increased my score by around about 500k just by cancelling the four and the five skill as soon as they're up and as soon as they're uh, ready, you know, as soon as they're activated. So no, no delay. Get that in. All right, guys. Thanks. Bye.